Our other st top story here at 10, a Rochester Hills mom making headlines tonight after testifying in front of Congress about how her two young sons died from fentanyl poisoning. Drugs investigators traced to Mexico. Mar McDonald live in Rochester Hills tonight. Mar, she testified in front of the Homeland Security Committee. Kimberly, that's right. That committee is taking a look at problems at our southern border, including fentanyl flowing into the U.S. I didn't know that my boys were taking anything that could kill them. They didn't think that they were either. Rebecca Kiesling's sons thought they had been given Percocet by a drug dealer. It turned out it was fentanyl, and both boys, 18 and 20, died the same day. They had five times the amount of fentanyl it takes to kill someone in their system. The House Homeland Security Committee is tackling how to fix our problems at the southern border, including the flow of fentanyl into the U.S. We need to protect our children, they didn't ask for that. This was not demand that they wanted the fentanyl. They didn't want fentanyl. They thought they were getting Percocets. Kiesling, who is a lawyer and anti-abortion activist, told me testifying may have been tough on her emotionally, but she sees a crisis at our southern border that killed her boys. You know, we, we have to secure our border. Again, if it were troops, you know, if there were Chinese troops amassed at our border with weapons of mass destruction, something would be done. We would secure our border really fast. Back here live, I asked Rebecca about the experience of testifying on Capitol Hill, and she said that both the Republican and Democratic members of the committee uh, were kind to her, that they offered their condolences. I asked her if she thought that they listened to her. She said, well, that's hard to tell. You know, in a committee hearing, you have members walking in and out of the committee hearing room all the time. So did, did it make an impact? Hard to tell. Let's see what happens policy-wise. We're in Rochester Hills tonight. I'm Mara McDonald, Local 4. What a really emotional testimony today. Mara, we appreciate your report.